What's up, internet? We're almost two years into the pandemic, and to be honest, the cabin fever drives me nuts sometimes. And I can't even see my friends IRL. But if I can't travel or even see my friends IRL, then at least I can make new friends online. So we reached out to some YouTubers in our region. You're going to meet the Tulfo of Malaysian PC building, learn the one insult you should never use on a Singaporean gamer, as well as the best explanation I've ever heard on how to tackle future proofing. We'll round that out with someone who's actually met the Linus Sebastian, of course, everybody's favorite LTT. Is he a nice guy in real life? Does he drop things as well when the camera is off? We'll find out. And finally, para sa ating mga OFWs, we also have someone from the Middle East talking about how the tech scene is there. But before all of those guys, you're going to meet our sponsor. Pero saan kukuha ng legit Windows? Daming options, daming prices. Pakalito. Buti na lang, may cdkeyoffers.com. Madali lang ang order. Search for the software you need, add to cart, daan ka sa payment options nila. Wala pang 5 minutes, finished. May legit, working cdkey ka na para sa Windows mo. Gamitin ang aming code para makakuha pa ng discounts. Kaya kung naghahanap ka ng legit, mura, at original software, check out cdkeyoffers.com We do get a lot of like, Fili uh, Philippine uh, traffic from the Philippines and, and I'm like really grateful for that as well because it's all organic. What I do for my audience is like where every store, every prominent store knows my name. Mm. So I would ask my um, audience to tell the ah. um, whichever store they go to yeah. that I sent them yeah. um, so that the store will take a little bit more <laughs> no. care with my audience. Maybe a, a store is, um, you know, the, the salesperson was being rude or yeah. something yeah. and they would text me. <laughs> I would call the <laughs> shop up and like, Dude, what up? Yeah. What, what, What's your problem? On? Yeah. yeah. Pino players, they, they love to use the voice chat and they are super aggressive. <laughs> yes. Everyone, yeah. top lane, top lane. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> like how are the gamers in Singapore? Are they like, like the, the people you meet online if you play with a lot of Singapore players? Are they, you know, are they kind of toxic? I mean, because Filipino players have that. Um, reputation, <laughs> you know, like we're very vocal and like we like to trash yeah. talk. Yeah, how are yeah. SG players? I, I, here's the thing. I think I think Singaporean uh, uh, hate haters, the toxic Singaporean gamers, <laughs> they they will really find the most I I, I don't know the most insulting thing they ah, can the, say the, the, to stick it to you. To, like, you yeah, to really, stick it to you. They yeah. they, they, they were really. They, they have a lot of brains, but they don't use it very well. That's the thing, you know? Okay. Like, like they would, there's, there's a rule, okay, in Singapore. Is it don't play mother. Uh, don't play mother, okay, really. Uh, yeah. Don't play mother? Don't play... Don't play mother, you know? Ah, your, okay. Your, your, your mother, yeah, okay. yeah. Just, just... Yeah. Er, everything is okay, but mother is off limits, yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. So, you can say anything else, but don't insult yeah. his mother, okay? Yes, yes. <laughs> So, oh. don't, so if so if, if if like someone accidentally like uh mentions someone's mom, everyone like hey, hey don't oh, play hey, mother uh, la, don't yeah, play yeah. mother. Uh, that's cross the line, yo. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Okay. You can insult every you can insult my ancestor, but not yeah. not not the mom. Not, not mom. the mom. mom okay. is, yeah, yeah. But because in the Philippines we, we we use that all the time. We, we have a particular yeah. expression that you know yes, very yes. Yeah, very yes. offensive. I, I know yeah. that one. Yes, okay? I know. <laughs> you come across some Filipino I, I, players, huh? Online. I play I play enough yeah. Dota to, yeah, yeah, to come yeah. across Just to know that. Yeah. Know players, okay. yes. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but okay, here's the thing. Okay, I, I, the, the the thing I like about Filipino players uh, is that y'all have a lot of passion. Huh? <laughs> yeah. uh, you have a lot of passion in gaming. So they have. My name is uh, Sutai Katima, also known as Katima Gaming on my YouTube channel. Um, I'm a university lecturer here at Chiang Mai, Thailand. Like almost American English. Um, did you study there or? No, not at all. Uh, I got this accent from the Philippines. Yeah, from, Everything from I here. Got. Yeah, yeah. From, from the Visayas. I studied in, in, in Dumaguete mm. uh, in Silliman for, for almost 10 years because in the early 2000s, K-12 was not adopted yet. Mm. So I took advantage of that by just taking four years in high school instead of six.
the term we use is called opus, original purpose. You have every ah, time when we that's good. people ask, yeah. yeah, opus. What's your opus? What was the original purpose of your computer? And you always have to think that. Don't forget that everything you use will always invalidate that original purpose. You have a phone. You say, "Oh, I just want to use it for school and, and communication." Yeah. All of a sudden, two, three years later, you're using it for gaming, and yeah. you're complaining yeah. it's not good enough. Yeah. You know, opus. Ah, so, I yeah. like that term. Huh? Is that um, I, this is the first time I've heard that term? It's it's prevalent in Thailand. Like a lot of people uh, enthusiastic yeah. use that term. Yeah, uh, because uh, the the term future proof. We don't be, since we don't use English. Anyways, to use it with the slang, we try to just say the term is called translated to positioning and opus, the original purpose of your computer. And if you tell them that set your original purpose higher yeah. than what you need now, you're gonna position yourself to to a longer. You stretch it out a little longer. You know, uh, I don't know whether you know this, but in Malaysia, uh, Filipinos are like like like. Not say labeled, but they are known as the very nice people. So, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so it's like it's like yeah. So it, I don't know whether you know that, but I every was... time it's like oh my god, they're so nice people, and and yeah, I mean I, I do have like few friends who were Filipinos when I was in college, and they were extremely nice. They are the nicest people on planet. Earth. I'm not saying it because you're a Filipino, but it's, it's good. <laughs> just was... so you know. Your correspondence with uh, Linus? Uh, I met him during an event for honor uh, in France. Met him, and yes, he he came with slippers with the socks on. <laughs> Into the event. Into the event. <laughs> <laughs> That's so Linus. Uh, he's cool. He was nice to talk to, but I feel like um, he is a very great person. And and um, but I think from a conversational point of view, I think someone like Anton will have a more deeper conversation with him because of the whole PC stuff. PC, PC life. Uh, for me, I had more conversation about him about stupid stuff because you know he has a very good uh, sense of humor. So we were talking non tech and because his wife is Singaporean, right? So he's super close to us. So we were just talking about stuff like that, and uh, and uh, yeah, so it was nice to talk to. And uh, I also met that that yeah. So yeah, so that's what I met. Him. Is he like? You know, um, legitimately very overactive. Like he's he's very energetic. I mean, like like he's not always energetic in the videos. Anyway, you know how he goes like ah, uh, he goes down, he goes up, and goes yeah. That's how he is. So what you see on the video is how exactly he is lah. Like. Um, as an OFW, siempre uh, looking tayo for other opportunities. So before I worked in Africa as an IT mm. IT employee. So dito ngayon lumipat ako don after three years. So ngayon five years na dito. As an IT consultant. So, if let's say, uh, where would you suggest? Like, I mean, the UAE, um, you know, mahilig ako sa PC parts. Where would you suggest na I shop? Parang ano yung parang Gilmore nila? <laughs> ah, okay, yeah. Um, not really Gilmore. Kung familiar kayo sir dati sa Cyber Zone sa SM North Edsa. Uh, ah, yeah. <laughs> dito sa Dubai sa Al Ain Plaza. So, Al Arshad Trade, oy, baka mapla. <laughs> Yun, yung may isang shop doon na uh, PM niyo na lang, may isang shop doon na okay yung uh, yung price uh, moderate pero kasi doon sa Al Ain Plaza na yun nandoon lahat yung computer shops. Ah. Uh, like kasi na, na you know, na, naranasan man yung pagbili bumili ng PC parts dito, tsaka bumili ng PC parts doon. Ano yung pagkaiba? Like is there any difference in the way like customers are or the way the sales staff are you know dito compared jan dito parang nagsasuggest talaga sila ng mga magandang alternatives hmm. noon ka experience ko dati baka sa akin lang naman hindi ko din alam parang medyo pag sumagot yung tech representative dun sa Gilmore parang parang hindi naman yan yung ano yung hindi parang uh, napapo, napupunta dun sa medyo mahal na suggestion uh-huh. Uh-huh. Ko. So, lilipat ako ng shop, maghahanap pa na pa ako. So, para sa experience ko lang naman, sir. Hindi ko naman sinasabing lahat, mm. pero that's wrong. Uh-huh. Big thanks to all the channels who participated. Katema Gaming from Thailand, Mob House from Malaysia, Julian Tech from Singapore, Adam Lobo from Malaysia, and Alex PC Tech from the UAE. Please do check them out. Their links are in the text description. All quality. To be honest, I really wanted to do this video because I think there's a lot of good tech coverage, both locally as well as in our own backyard. Top of mind kasi yung mga big Western tech channels. But there's a lot of content quite close by 
that is quality and that should be encouraged and supported. Kasama ni si Hardware Sugar dun, of course, sana, but a lot of other great Asian YouTubers as well. If you think we should reach out to other channels, please say so in the comments and thanks for watching. And thank you to our top fans. Na afford na namin tuko puan nato. Dejo klang. Thank you to Leah Magnaye, Ian Meru, Richard Ongkinko, ITX Addict, John Ruben Ocha, Christian Espinosa, and Rafael James. Thank you for supporting the channel.